The whole year season is the perfect time to spread joy and give the gift of growth. Personal development is an ongoing process and this celebration season presents a great opportunity to invest in it. Whether investing in yourself or someone you love, there are countless options to foster personal development. You want to give a gift that truly keeps on giving? Consider one of these self-improvement options and help someone you care about to take the first step towards a happier, healthier, and more fulfilling life. Hi friends, if this is your first time here, you are welcome. My entire YouTube channel is dedicated to helping you reinvent yourself and start a new and purpose-driven life. I make these videos to share my pet transformation journey and remind you that you are not a failure just because you failed at some things at some point. You are a work in progress. Yes, there is always room for improvement. Also, it is never too late to reinvent yourself. And you are never too old to start a new life or to have a new dream. Remember, this time you are restarting with a lot of experiences and learned lessons to take empowered action and build back better. And action, they say, is the prescription for success. Make sure you subscribe to my channel so I can help you too. You are just one decision away to an extraordinary life. The holiday season is a great time to think about personal growth and development. If you are looking for some gift ideas to help you or someone you love to grow and to improve, here are some suggestions in this video. One, a journal. You can consider gifting a journal to your friend or to yourself because writing is a great way to reflect on your thoughts and feelings and track your progress over time. Journaling is a powerful tool that can help you improve mental health, increase self-awareness, better memory retention, and enhance your creativity. So writing about your experiences can help you gain clarity, help you process difficult emotions and find solutions to problems. Like expert says, what gets written gets done. So you might, might want to find a journal where you can write down all the things that you want to do or the things that you want to become and you work towards them. Because each time you're looking at your journal, you are reminded of the promises and the commitment that you made to yourself. And two, the second gift idea that I would recommend at this season is a book on personal development. There are countless books out there on everything you can think about. So you might want to choose a book in line with your interest or the interest of the person you are gifting. For example, The Seven Habits of Highly Effective People by Stephen Covey is one of the classics that has helped millions of, of people to like help them become more effective in all areas of their lives, including prioritizing, managing time, setting and achieving goals, building me meaningful relationships. Or you can just get like for my friend, Sana, the best is yet to come. This is a, a real book that helps you to dig deep, to dig deep inside you to find yourself, to rediscover yourself. And so, whether you're thinking of gifting yourself or anybody, find the gift that is appropriate to the person's activity, the gift that will help them to grow. The third gift that you can give someone or yourself during this season is a fitness tracker. Like staying active is essential for physical and mental health and a fitness tracker can help you set and achieve goals. So whether you're working in your home, you're just going out for a walk or you're going to the gym, but that tracker is what will give you the evidence that you are making progress. And you know, our minds 
are constructed in a way that we always need evidence to keep us motivated and to keep us growing. Another thing that you can gift someone during this period or yourself is a meditation app. You know, there are so many new and affordable apps every day. Find the one that is great for you, that is useful for you, because these apps are a great way to reduce your stress and improve focus. And there are many of them out there that can help you to guide your meditations and other tools that can help you to focus. You might also want to give to yourself a new course, a workshop, or just buy something that will help you to learn something new. Maybe you've been wanting to, whether a, to take cooking classes or learn a new language or a business workshop or learning any new skill for that matter or knowledge that can help you to grow and improve. This is a time to think of how to gift yourself that gift that will continue giving, that will make you to continue growing. In the sixth place, like the sixth gift that I would uh, suggest to you is to buy a planner. Gift someone a planner. A planner will help you to track your schedule and your to-do or to-be list and this can help you stay organized and on top of your goals. I have my planner from Oprah like making a, the life you want the life you want planner from Oprah because I'm part of Oprah's insiders and so even if it's not the one from Oprah, find yourself a planner that will help you to keep track of your schedule and will help you to stay organized and on top of your goals. The seventh gift idea that I will propose for you today is to find a set of motivational posters. Surround yourself with positive messages and affirmations that can help you to stay motivated and focused. I have what well, this is not my my place, but I have a lot of them in my box, and I have a lot of them around me, and I have a lot of like. If you even go to my channel, you will see a whole video on I am uh, affirmations. I have my affirmations. I have lots of all of those uh, positive sayings in my community page. If you go to my community page, you will find a lot of motivational uh, postings there. Gift yourself a gratitude journal. I can never stop talking about a gratitude journal because cultivating a sense of gratitude and appreciation can it will always help you to improve your overall well-being and happiness. And I gave you like, if you watch my other video, there's one tip about a gratitude journal that I shared, one story that I shared, and I can't stop sharing that story of a husband who gifted his wife a gratitude journal on their anniversary, on their wedding anniversary. And what he did, their wedding anniversary is in on the 14th of February, on Valentine's Day. And so what he did he was he had given her most of all the expensive gifts that you can imagine. But finally, he thought, I really want a gift that will be priceless, but very, very valuable. And so he decided to buy a beautiful journal and lots of colored pens. And in his own handwriting, every day he wrote two things for which he was grateful for his wife for. And on the, <laughs> on the, after 365 days, he had a journal, gratitude journal for his wife, 365 times two of the things that he is grateful for his wife for. And I tell you, when he shared that story, he's, he was like, this is the gift that I was looking to give to my wife. Because when she received it, I saw the joy in her face, like the joy of when we first had our first kiss. And the joy of seeing her reading that journal every day. So if you have your gratitude journal, and I tell you, even if you write just one thing that you are grateful for every day, and I'm sure when you go to write, you will find every day that you have more than one or two or three things to be grateful for. 
try it in one year you will produce yourself an excellent autobiography that will keep you motivated that's why i can't stop thinking about and talking about the gratitude journal i have a video about a gratitude journal on my page you can check that out the ninth gift idea is just buy a set of healthy cookbooks because eating is very essential for physical and mental health and a set of healthy cookbooks can provide inspiration and new ideas you know after covid every one of us learn how to cook our own food and i think and i pray that that is a habit that we have all cultivated and have kept because when you cook your own food at least when you can it is better because you are sure of what you put in your pot and you are sure of what you are eating so it's very easy to learn how to cook for some of us we grew up they taught us our parents taught us how to cook because from the part of the world where i come from i come from cameroon if a woman doesn't know how to cook that's a catastrophe so the girls they teach you how to cook but my parents taught every one of us boys or girls because my mother had more boys everybody in my house cooks very well and so this is the time for you to give yourself that special those special menus recipes that you always like you can really just cook them yourself because most of the cookbooks they have the recipes well presented you and the ingredients and even the steps that you take them so you just need to put them together and i tell you when you even go to the supermarket most of the ingredients like fresh ingredients they have already been cut off they are very really chopped into pieces you don't need to do all those the extra work and stuff you just come and assemble them and cook them and you will be as healthy as you have never been so another gift idea that you can give to someone or to yourself membership to a gym or a fitness studio because like we say regular exercises is essential for physical health and also can be great a great way to meet people and build a sense of community so the idea is not if you are a lazy person to go to the gym like me the idea of going to a gym club is not because only because of the exercises because you could do the working outside you could do but you also need a community of people who would you would associate with who you are building with who you are learning from and all of that so it's not good to be only on your own if you can find a community even go to the the community centers the ymcas for those of you who are in in north america you have all of those places where it's a convenient place where you can meet new people and you can network and grow you can you don't imagine the kind of people you can meet in those places when you are going out so going out for a walk alone or to hike alone is good but also going to where you can find many people is is even more beneficial because you cannot grow to alone you need community you need community but you select be selective find people who are like-minded who are open-minded and who can help you grow so all of these gift ideas that i'm sharing they are just random gift ideas for this season because sometimes you are so we have so many things out there in the market we don't know what we can gift even to ourselves or to the people we love so you have just a few list of them and remember that personal growth and development is an ongoing process and the whole day season presents a great opportunity to invest in it the gift ideas like i said listed above are just a few examples of how you can support yourself or someone you love in their journey towards self-improvement and remember the most important thing is to find something that resonates with you or that resonates with you personally and to approach it with an open mind and a willingness to learn and grow we're always talking about be willing your willingness to learn and grow so whether it is through writing reading fitness learning positivity gratitude or healthy eating there are endless ways to foster your growth and development and this holiday season please consider giving the gift of self improvement and watch how you will flourish or how the person will flourish so 
I know that most often we always gift people. We forget to gift ourselves. Find a gift for yourself amongst one of the gifts that I have listed above and gift yourself. And always bear in mind that your willingness to try becomes your inspiration to continue growing. You are not a failure just because you failed at some things at some point. You are a work in progress and there is always room for improvement. I am, a, I am your friend on your new journey to the best part of your life. Remember, I do not have a magic solution. No, I am your guide into self-discovery to help you unlock inbuilt answers and take empowered action to become your best version. If you want to really talk with me one-on-one, -on -one, send me a direct message on Instagram in the link below this video for a free clarity call. Thank you for watching. Enjoy the season. I'll see you in my next video.